Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Grams. Wisdom is the final frontier in gaining true knowledge. We are on our daily trek to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friends. This is Gramps. Thanks for coming along on today's trek as we increase wisdom and create a living legacy. We are told in Proverbs chapter 16, verse 16, how much better to get wisdom than gold and sound judgment than silver. We are on day 1,685 of our trek and it is time to explore another nugget of wisdom which includes an inspirational quote along with some wise words from Gramps for today's trek. If you apply the words that you hear today, over time, it will help you to become more healthy, wealthy, and wise as you continue on your daily trek of life. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. And today's quote is from B.B. Warfield, and it is, A firm faith in the universal providence of God is the solution to all earthly troubles. So today's nugget is, A firm faith. All of us have faith, at least to some degree. Even if you do not believe in the personal God who created us to be His imagers, you still have faith. Every time you sit down on a chair, you have faith that it will hold you. Every time you get into a car, you have faith that you will reach your destination. So the question we need to ask ourselves, especially as Christ followers, is our faith strong enough in the universal providence of God that we can cease to worry about that which we have no control? If not, what can we do to strengthen our faith? We certainly won't have all the answers, but here is where faith comes in. The writer of Hebrews chapter 11 verses 1 through 3 reminds us, Faith shows us the reality of what we hope for. It is the evidence of things we cannot see. Through their faith, the people in the days of old earned a good reputation. By faith, we understand the entire universe was formed at God's command, that what we now see did not come from anything that can be seen. If we have faith that God created the entire universe, then why do we struggle and doubt that He will provide for us on our daily needs? Instead, we need to depend on ourselves less and depend on God more. And our passage for today is Matthew chapter 6, verse 31 through 34. So don't worry about these things, saying, What will we eat? What will we drink? What will we wear? These things dominate the thoughts of the unbelievers, but your heavenly Father already knows all your needs. Seek the kingdom of God above all else and live righteously, and He will give you everything you need. So don't worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will bring its own worries. Today's trouble is enough for today. And as you ponder this nugget of wisdom for yourself, please encourage your friends and family to join us, and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you'd like to listen to any of the past 1,684 treks or read the wisdom journals, they are all available at wisdom-trek.com. And I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on your favorite podcast player so that each day's trek will be downloaded to you automatically. And if you've not done so, please consider giving us a 5-star rating so that others will join us in mining our nuggets of wisdom. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, But most importantly, I am your friend as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek Podcast Journal each day. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you tomorrow for more Daily Wisdom.